Welcome back, y'all, to Shy Talk. Um, this is Chris the Flash. I want to talk about some Saints news. I wanted to talk about this yesterday, but uh, I was too busy. But I'm gonna talk about it today. And I know, I, you know, I gave my time, myself some time to, you know, get my mind right about this this topic and situation. But um, I want to talk about Sean Payton. If y'all do know, or if y'all don't know, or what's been going on. But Sean Payton has stepped down for being a Saints coach. He's retired um, after 16 seasons. He, he's he been to three NFC championship games. He brought us a Super Bowl. Um, to be honest with you, he should have more than one Super Bowl. He's going to be very missed in the, in the locker room. He's going to be missed on the field. Um, something something about him. He, he wasn't just a coach. Um he was, you could tell he was a natural born leader when it comes to being a, a football coach. He got, you know, he, he got preparation every day from his players. He uh, demanded a lot from his players. I know, he, you know, he, he said he's taking time off, but he does see himself coaching again. I know it won't be for the Saints. I know that most likely he's probably going to go somewhere else. The only good thing is, it, he's still under contract, so if he wants to go to another place to go coach, um, we got the rights to him, so we would have to trade him to somebody. I know it's not logical, but hey, at least we get something back if we if we if we trade him. So there's a, a couple coaches that has been interviewing with the Saints, like Brian Leftwich and um, Aaron Glenn. And D.A., Dennis Allen. But the one coach I do want to replace Sean Payton is Michigan's uh, head coach, Jim Harbaugh. I I remember when when he was with the 49ers, he almost won the Super Bowl against his brother. He has a winning record everywhere he goes. If the Saints want to keep on winning and keep steady, with the organization, I think they should they should sign Jim Harbaugh out of Michigan. That's just my opinion. It's either him or DA. You know, I, I heard other names too. Um, like uh, I think it's Doug Peterson, formerly Eagles Super Bowl winning coach. I, I don't mind him. He has some ties to Louisiana. I just I want I want to get back to how we, you know we were before. Uh, the, or after the Super Bowl, because we should have won more Super Bowls when we had Sean Payton and Drew Brees, and we didn't. One of them, I mean, we all know we got cheated out. One of them, because I think that year we would have we would have beat the Patriots, and we all know the the no call, the pass interference against the Rams in the NFC Championship game. That that was our win, but I mean we can't do nothing about it now. It already happened, but I just want to wish Sean Payton. Um, the best wishes, you know, to him and his family. Um, you know, I support whatever he does. He he's definitely going to Hall of Fame. Um, Saints and NFL. He's one of the best coaches that that ever coached in the NFL. He's the best coach for the New Orleans Saints. And like I said, I wish him the best. All right, y'all. Um, I think that's it for this topic. Whatever happens now, like when they hire a new coach, I'm gonna I'm gonna make another video and I'm gonna let y'all get an update what's what's been you know going on with the Saints. I hope y'all have a blessed day.